Hello everyone, welcome to Good Morning Tarot. Now, this is a general reading and it is open to all zodiac signs. So just take what resonates with you. It is also timeless, so anytime you find yourself watching this video, there might be a message here for you. Now let's try to see what is the main energy at the start of the day. Okay, we have here the Strength card. Leo, you are on fire. And you have a certain confidence, a certain courage within you that will allow you to accomplish whatever challenges you are encountering right now. So at this time, you have that courage and that uh, confidence to get things done. And it is coming from that strength that is coming from within. So in a certain sense, you have developed a certain degree of maturity already that allows you to face life's challenges with confidence. You are very much in touch also of the divine as is symbolized by that eternity sign in the arm of this lady. You see here, there's that lion part and then that gentle part. So in a certain sense, I feel the message for us right now is to temper that gentleness, uh, to empower that gentleness with courage, but at the same time to temper that courage with gentleness. So to attain a certain balance between being gentle, but at the same time also assertive enough and courageous enough to get things done. At the same time also to have good boundaries. So there is a balance between generosity to others and also self-love and self-care. Now let's try to see how this will further unfold. Okay, we have here the Queen of Wands. You're the Queen of Wands. You are really on fire, just like the lion in the strength card and then there's that gentleness of the lamb now you are on fire just like the queen of wands you are highly creative for some of you you have a gift with music <clears throat> so a certain sense you what comes to me is you are able to play an instrument and make that instrument sing so i think that is a little bit more specific for some of you but there is that gift of creativity and you are on fire and you have that certain confidence of the queen of wands the queen of wands is not afraid to be unique to be different so try to see how that resonates with you now what is the advice of the universe for us well for some of you there might be something that you will have to address maybe right now or in the near future it is something that has caused you pain in the recent past uh, for some of you, maybe a healing of a past hurt also. It can be a past hurt that is a long time ago, or it can be a recent past hurt. Uh, there is a broken trust for some of you. You might have trusted something, uh, somebody, and that trust has been broken, and there is a need for you also to heal. I think here, the card of the strength will help you a lot in addressing this hurt. Uh, with the courage card, you are you remain kind also to those who are concerned in the situation but at the same time also you are firm enough to stand for what you deserve for your right so in a certain sense uh, the strength card can help you handle these three of swords and also being the queen of wands also being on fire will allow you also to undergo the process of healing much faster so in a certain sense, for some of you, part of the, this growth, this creativity, for some of you, there will be also healing of past wounds. Now, um, you need not have to worry. Uh, you have that courage and you have that gentleness to, to handle the situation. And you are somebody who's on fire, somebody who is able to care for yourself, while at the same time also being in a certain sense understanding of other people's situation so uh, just don't be surprised if there be there will be some situations wherein you feel betrayed or you feel that you uh, somebody has betrayed your trust uh, you will have to attend to it uh, just go with the flow of the spirit uh, be in touch with the spirit so that you'll be able to make it through 
you have the strength and the courage to make it through this three of swords. So do not worry about it. Part of life's journey are challenges like those of the three of swords. Now let's go to Good Morning Oracle. For Good Morning Oracle, we have here the Cosmic Reading Cards. Now we'll get a random card and try to see what is the Oracle message for today. Be fearless. Okay, so amidst this Tree of Swords, something that is causing you pain, maybe for some of you, uh, you feel betrayed in one way or another. It can be related to your career, friendship, can be romantic. It can be also part of your family relationships. No? Whatever it is, use the strength and the courage that comes from within, given by the strength card, and use it to be fearless. Don't be afraid to face this tree of swords. You can be the queen of wands, somebody who can still find positive things and joy in whatever challenges she encounters. She is creative, she is on fire, and she knows how to protect herself. So in a certain sense, the strength card is also like that. So uh, take that courage that comes from within and have that courage to face life's challenges, especially those three of sorts. Be fearless. Well, that's it for today. I hope that it has helped you in your present life situation. Thank you for the likes and comments you've given to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. I hope to see you again soon. Until that time, may God continue to bless your ways.